Welcome to WatchGuard's Daily Security Byte. I'm Corey Nockheiner. Today's story is a gamer DDoS dying. This is just going to be a really short update to a story a couple weeks back. You probably remember that the Internet of Things botnet called Mirai was used to DDoS a DNS middleman called Dyne. And a few weeks back, both on the East Coast and the West Coast, this big DDoS attack caused a number of websites to go down simply because Dyne is a DNS middleman. At the time, no one was really sure who was behind this attack, but due to the election, some people suspected it could be nation states, perhaps trying to do certain tests. However, the latest information is this could just be an angry gamer. According to the CSO of Level 3, they suspect this was some sort of lone hacker that had rented the underground services to use the Mirai botnet to actually DDoS a unnamed gaming company, although people inside sources suspect it could be the PlayStation Network. Now, the CSO didn't share any evidence, didn't share any concrete facts about why they believe this. However, it's not unprecedented. We've seen groups like the Lizard Squad do a lot of DDoS attacks against a number of gaming companies. However, it is kind of interesting to see some lone angry gamer that's just DDoSing a gaming company can cause so much damage to many different sites because of this DNS middleman. Now, this news of this just being an angry gamer doesn't take away the fact that uh, Internet of Things botnet like Mirai poses a lot of risk. In fact, it actually makes it worse to think that some random angry gamer can pay a small amount of money just to DDoS organizations and have such a big result is kind of concerning. Anyways, just an interesting update I thought I would share. That's it for today's story. Thank you for watching.